Hey you guys, coming at you with a commissary and Walmart haul. Really, really um, small item at Walmart that I actually did last night. But I figured I'd just throw that in this video. Because you know how I do. Let's put it together. Um, but actually this video is going to be a commissary and Walmart haul. Um, for those of you guys that in my area, um, you know who you are. Those of you that haven't made it to the commissary for the K-slot sale, um, well, I guess you say sidewalk sale. It's not a, really a K-slot sale. For the sidewalk sale, um, I'm going to show you some of the things that I got that I thought was really, really good. Now, mind you, there are coupons for some of these items, but I went early this morning because I have stuff to do later, and I just got the items as this on that was on the sale price without throwing in... Um, extra coupons that they had at the commissary because it that didn't start if you wanted the items with the coupons that started at 10 o'clock because they had to have time to go out there and put it on there so i didn't wait for the extra coupons i was totally fine with just getting the deals the way they are now because i really just wanted to get out of there that was the purpose of me going in there early so if you decide to go there and do some of these deals just know um it may be a little bit cheaper if there's a coupon for that item, but I did not wait, and I still think it's good items. Uh, well, good prices. Mm, let's see. Yeah, that's it for the comments here. And if you're not affiliated with it and you want to watch this video, go ahead and watch it. Um, those of you that's not in my area but still um, are able to, you know, shop at a commissary or whatever, be mindful of the case lot sales and the sidewalk sales make sure you you know keep up with when they do that because it'd be really really good deals um okay let's get started let's start with the commissary um let's see oh, i hope this works i'm using a selfie stick now so bear with me you see okay let's start here these things right here the little el paso bowl ranch flavored taco shells um i had a receipt because i forgot where my receipt went mm. hold on okay for these cool for these um things they were regular price you know they was a dollar ninety nine each, so a dollar nine for these, a dollar ninety nine each. I thought it was a good deal. We may have a coupon that I didn't have to use, like a manufacturer coupon, rather than the military store coupon. But I think it's a good price for them, so I got them. So I ended up getting four of those. The um, vegetable oil was one ninety nine, so I got three of those. These right here, I like these waters. The splash. Um, they was 99 cents, um, a case. I mean, 99 cents for a six pack. And it may be coupons on it because last time we had those manufacturer coupons, I did use mine on this same water at the commissary because it made them like 49 cents or something like that after using that coupon. I think the coupon was like a 55 cent coupon or something. But yeah, you guys, I end up getting, as you can see, um, I got three of each. So three of the grapes and three of the lemons. Um, let's see. I know this video is like crazy. Y'all like really she did that? I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Um the sugar. I can't remember. I had a four pound bag of sugar. Um let's see. It was a dollar ninety eight. So a dollar ninety eight for one of these. Um the canned fruit, I got fruit cocktail. And I got the sliced peaches, and I have like two, three, four, five, six. I got seven cans all together, and they were 65 cents each. So I thought that was good for this size, 65 cents each. Um, the Gatorade, this size, I ended up getting four. Um, and they were. Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Uh, come on. I don't see. I know they're on here somewhere. But I don't see them. You remember how much the Gatorade was? Uh, never. No, that wouldn't be the sports drinks. 
Huh? 276? For two? That's not right. That can't be right. The sports drink is a 276, two at 279. Then that's your waters. The Gatorade's right there. Okay. Gatorades were 69 cents. I was overlooking it. Um, so yeah, I got four of those. Then I got four of these um Rago. The ragu um sauces because it's easy to make the kids some pasta and sauce it's just pretty much the same as the shelf variety when you get the noodles and the actual you know um just the noodles and the sauce so yeah the ragu was uh, i have four i think it was like a dollar 25 that's what it was that was a dollar 25 then i like to have raviolis and cheese so I just bought this. I think these was three dollars. So I got an extra, um, extra sharp cheddar, and then the um, medium cheddar. So then I saw these. I never saw these like in this. I know they probably been out, but I just haven't saw them. They the string cheese and pepperoni flavored meat sticks. So I thought these would be good for when I go up to the school, wait on the kids, and I'd be wanting to have like a snack or something because I want to try to eat a little bit healthier. I don't know how that's going to um, But, yeah. So, I got two packs of these. And I think they were... Let's see. Hmm. I'm not really looking for... I'm looking at stuff on receipts. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I don't know. I think these was like a dollar twenty-five or something, or dollar fifty or something like that. I don't. I can't find them on the receipt. And then we got some. The kids love these um French toast. So got a pack of those. Probably not gonna be able to find that on here neither. Oh, yep. Um, got a pack of those for two thirty-nine. Yep. Then, it's mosey on over here. The Tulsa Strudels. I did use my manufacturer coupon for these. Um, these are $1.50. I end up getting the Wildberry, the Boston Cream Pie, and then... Now, this is the trick. All of them was $1.50. But this got 6 in it, I guess because of the flavors. This got 6 in it. But these got 12 in it, and they still was $1.50. So, that's why I got 3 boxes of the 12 ones but i also wanted to taste these so i just went on and got these so there's a dollar fifty each and we have a 50 cents off coupon off of one so i used five 50 cents off coupons and it made them a dollar a box so can't beat that um also they had a little clearance section so we found some teriyaki sauce for like a dollar so i got that and then my favorite deal i got five of these you guys it's so easy to um um, feed the kids with this. Um, these are the Smuckers, the Smuckers, Uncrustable, <laughs> Uncrustable Peanut Butter and Strawberry Jam Sandwiches. These retail was, retail price was $9 and some change, but they had them on sale for $3.99. So yeah, I, I may go back and get some more, I'm not sure, but I got five boxes and these has 18 in each box. So, yeah, that was a really, really good deal, I think. So, that does it for the, and I know y'all going to probably be looking at this video and be like, halfway feeling dizzy and stuff. You can be looking at it sideways. I'm sorry. That's the way I was able to record it right now. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's in it for my little haul for the commissary. Um... I paid like $70 for everything, but it's worth it because I was able to stock up on the kids' breakfast, um, 
get a couple of drinks. I wanted the meat sauce. So, you know, you got to get it while you can when it's really, really cheap. So, it's better for me to get it now than to go to the store later this week or next week and end up having to pay more. So, yeah, I took advantage of some of the deals. And like I said, it was coupons coming out starting at 10 o'clock for some of this stuff. I just did not have time to wait because that's why I'm, I'm rushing with this video now. Let me show you the two things that I got from Walmart last night those of you that's in my area it was the richlands walmart um they had the some of their cakes marked down like over in the bakery um area and i thought it was really really good prices let me show you i don't know if you can see okay this is one um it's like a red velvet some type of chocolate. No, you say chocolate, German chocolate, red velvet, and carrot cake. This, if I can pick it up with one hand. I think I got it. I think I got it. I got it. Um, as you can see, was can you see that? It was nine dollars and nine cents, and I got it for three dollars and eighty nine cents. Can't beat that. The other one was a red velvet cake. I love red velvet cake, so it was a plus for me. This one, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. It was, um, no. Well, yeah, it was $9.48, and I got it for $2.84. So, yeah. You guys, be very mindful of different things when you go into stores because you never, you know, never know. I'm going to look up and see if I can freeze those because they, be, they, they may be able to be frozen I'm not sure I never froze a cake, but I know if I don't do something with it, I'm going to eat it. And it may not be a good thing. Um, but if you can come across deals like that around since the holiday season is coming up with, you know, Thanksgiving and stuff like that, it will be coming soon. So if you can find stuff like that and look up and see if you can freeze it or, you know, how you can um, store it to, for long term then that'll be good good deals because that's $20 that's like let's just say $21 no yeah just say $20 um two cakes for $20 that would have been like $20 or some change or whatever and we actually paid I'm rounding off six bucks for them. can't beat that so yeah so yeah I hope you guys like this video um I really have a lot of stuff I got to do today. That's why this video is so crazy. So sorry. I don't even know how to use this selfie stick. Crazy. All I can do is just do it, you know, up and, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Y'all know how I do. Um, but yeah, hope you like this video. Um, I think I covered everything. Don't forget to come over to the Facebook page. Um, Pinch and Pennies, Couponing for a Cause, Truth and the Homeless. And I told you guys the reason why I got that long name is because once I get things back on track, I will be putting different things that I will be donating to the homeless and stuff like that. So I just said it's better to just do couponing and everything in one group. So, yeah, come over, send me a request to join the group. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for being patient and waiting while I wasn't doing my videos and stuff like that. But, um... Yeah, I'm going to stop rambling. <laughs> um, until next time, happy savings.